Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. And a Brooklyn deli owner is getting creative and trying to stop a group of teens who he says reportedly, repeatedly shoplift from his store, so he's shaming them. Fox 5's Richard Giacova shows us how he came up with his Thieves of the Week videos and if they're making any difference. It looks like a video put out by the NYPD to try and catch some thieves. You could see these four young ladies inside the Green Olives Deli and Grill Juice Bar in Park Slope. While one keeps watch, another girl swipes some snacks and chips and stuffs them inside her coat. They all walk out without paying. They keep doing that every single day. And whenever they come, I have to keep an eye on them. I have to watch the cameras every time, so it gives me a hard time. But instead of involving police, deli owner Majid Albari decided to take matters into his own hands. Every week, anyone steals, I'm going to put them in the TV so other kids, they can learn from it and stop doing it. Majid says the repeated shoplifting at this corner bodega has forced him to play the video of those teens on a loop above the counter so everyone can see it. He calls it the thieves of the week. I think after what happens, it's going to be a good lesson for them to stop doing this again. Majid believes this same group of girls are coming from the John Jay Educational Campus, which sits about four blocks away from here. But they aren't the only offenders. According to police stats, petty and grand larceny is up more than half for the first nine months of 2022 compared to the year before. I think it's right. You don't want to you want to end up on that screen. So it's a big lesson for all the kids coming in here and being like, maybe they're plotting, maybe they're not. But now definitely not plotting. If you're seeing this as if it's public, it's like, it's hard to avoid, you know what I mean? Like, you feel the accountability of stealing, so you're not going to feel that as much if it's at, not as public. Majid doesn't want to get anyone in trouble, he just wants this to stop. And if it takes a little public shaming to do it, so be it. It's not about the money, that's why I put it. I put it there because I want them to stop doing it, because it's not good for them to grow up in this habit, bad habit, you know. In the Park Slope section of Brooklyn, Richard Giacovis, Fox 5 News. I mean, this is sad the way we've kind of resorted to this. He also went to talk to the principal of the school. He knows where the kids go to school. And right now the principal's like, what could I do? Well, that video will definitely... Uh, put some shame into folks if they walk in or their friends see their face Or maybe their plastered. parents are watching today. Sounds like they need a... I know what my parents used to do. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.